Hey, I'm Zeta Sage Plays. Welcome to the first Zoo Tour of 2023. It's the Living Wetland Center by Thrive. This build is absolutely gorgeous. Let's jump in and check it out. All right, so here we are at the Living Wetland Center. And oh my God, it really does feel like it's living. The way the steam rises off the water in the morning light, it's just such a gorgeous build. This is a really tiny little build, basically just this one building that you can see here with some wetland animals in it. But it may be small, but it is perfectly formed and we're gonna go and take a look around it. I love the way we got these little um, wetland environments around the outside of it. There's no animals in here, it's just to set the scene with all these reeds. And like I say, the steam coming off the water is amazing. And then this building is gorgeous. This roof. This was built by Thrive. Uh, you can see it on his YouTube channel. But this isn't a new build. This is from the Wetlands Animal Pack sort of era. Um, I remember seeing it somewhere, maybe on Reddit, and I downloaded it and then forgot all about it. <laughs> I found it the other day, uh, loaded it up, and it just blew me away. If you enjoyed the um, Wild Americas tour that we did a few months ago, I think you're really gonna enjoy this one because it is a similarly really realistic small build get a little peek inside here let's go in and take a look around so we got a wheelchair ramp here and then steps there some really nice fencing and this big otter statue up here just above the logo and yeah it's really nice scene setting here Love these doors as well. Let's take a look around. So I've only very briefly been inside here, so let's see what we've got. Some nice education up on the walls there. And terrapins here. Can't see any. Ah, there's one. Very cute. Oh, I really like these custom posters. I never bother making posters out of pieces. I always just use the billboards. It takes a lot of skill to put stuff like this together. That's so really nice. So here we have our first habitat animal, the platypus. Oh, what an amazing little habitat with the underwater viewing here. Little area for them to dive in. And some really nice rock work up at the back there. No sign of any platypi at this point, uh, but I'll drop them in in a cinematic when I find them. Great use of all the... Oh, okay, so we got some of the actual tree pieces and then the fake tree pieces as well. That's a really nice um, arrangement. That feels really natural. And we got something else around here. I wonder if this is, I wonder if the platypus can get into both of these or it's two separate habitats. Maybe this is something else we'll see around the corner. Oh, we've got some otters over here. There's one. That's a really nice habitat. <laughs> a little cardboard box for them to play with. Oh yeah. Nice. And then some over here. Yeah, maybe this is an implied habitat. I don't see anything in it. It's really nice though. Now what do we have through here? Okay, so we got the crested newts in here. somewhere <laughs> please give a small exhibits frontier <laughs> just everything just feels so real in here though I love builds like this when you really feel like you're in an actual facility rather than a sort of planet zoo style everything's huge kind of thing and then this is the largest area 
we have some spectacled caiman down here. Look how shallow that pool is. And what a great view out the window as well. And then finally over here, we have American bullfrogs. I really like that viewing window and the way he's raised the um, exhibit off the floor, I think, a little bit. Let's see. Uh, maybe not. Maybe a tiny bit off the floor. It just sits in really nicely. Feels like a more appropriate size if you had quite a few of them in here. But yeah, this is just a gorgeous little build. Great work from Thrive. Uh, you can see this on his own channel and loads of other stuff that they do as well. So um, check that out. I'll put a link in the description as always. Uh, I really hope you enjoyed this mini zoo tour for the first tour of 2023. And I will see you again soon. Thanks for watching. Bye.